Well, howdy, 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 y'all. Teresa here, and just me and the critters. Critter cam, critter cam. Charlie, again, come up here. Come here, Charlie. Are you coming up? Come on up. Come on up. Oh, you see Nixie right there behind me? You see it, Charlie? <laughs> Hi, Charlie. How are you doing? Charlie, hey. Hello? Charlie, what do you think? Look at, look at, look at, look at, Charlie. What are you doing, goofball? Are you a good boy? Are you a good boy, Charlie? Hmm? Are you a good boy? I'm the good boy. Oh, I know. And then Mama laying on the other side of him. So that's the critter camp. And then Angel is laying back on the bed. How are you doing today, Lexi? Are you a good guy? Mm -hmm. I love you, too. I love you too, baby girl. Oh, 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 you're such a pretty girl, huh? Yes. <clears throat> so anyway, that's the dogs. It is April 23rd, 2017, Sunday afternoon. It is 1.48 p.m. Today marks the one-year anniversary of us arriving down here in Florida and actually arriving down here to this RV park. So it's been a full year. No regrets. No regrets. I feel positive about the future. Things will fall into place when they're meant to, is meant to happen. So, yeah. The only, I miss, I miss my daughters and my grandchildren horribly. So much. But, you know, we call and, and everything. So, uh, you know, that's the only thing that I really miss them so much. But, uh, you know. That's life. So, but just text me going to lunch about 15 minutes. So I better speed this sucker up. <laughs> it is uh, no bra Sunday. So if you got them, let them hang. <laughs> it is 82 degrees. Real fill is 86. The high will be 82. The low will be 57. It's a little bit cooler of a day, but it's a clear uh, day. It looks like a million diamonds dancing on the bay waters right now. The tide is coming in. So oh, that's very cool. Hey, Charlie. Charlie, hello. Hello. Thank you. Oh, I know. So anyway, I'll pull out my little notebook. While Charlie's huffing and puffing. <laughs> I know. You're so silly. Anyway, yesterday you guys saw me open that package. And thank you again so much, Melanie. Um, and uh, I cleaned house. And... Brad made breakfast for dinner, which he made um, sausage gravy. So we had biscuits and gravy, and then he made some scrambled eggs. Um, and uh, I was finishing cleaning some stuff. And then um, after dinner, and I didn't even ask him to, but he just, he does enjoy spinning the yarn. You know, I have one of those uh, hand crank um, uh, yarn winders. Uh, inexpensive one I picked up used off of eBay. I think I either paid between ten and fifteen dollars free shipping. I can't remember exactly how much. But anyway, whenever I get in more yarn, I put it all in a specific tote bag and um uh then he winds it all for me. Uh and he enjoys it because he gets out his table. He's got this whole system out and he always paper clips the end of the yarn. Uh and stuff so we can easily find it. But he's got this whole system. And he, like I said, he gets the Netflix on his phone. He props his phone up. He's got his, his, he's either got his cordless headphones on or else, you know, his Bluetooth ones or else he is watching TV. Last night he was watching Netflix. And he just goes to town and he has a great time. You know, he enjoys the colors and stuff too. I know that, that my friend Donna said, you know, if there were some colors I didn't like just to gift them on down the road. I loved all the colors. I loved all the colors. And Brad wound all of them up last night. And I always love, I'm very mesmerized by color anyway. No, no, no wonder, you know, because I have Asperger's and, and I'm, I uh, am an artist too. So I'm always very mesmerized by color. 
and even have you know when he's spinning it i can see all the different colors and it, all of that yarn is just so beautiful so it's all going to be put to good use trust me um so he did that and of course i did some little um i got a couple more hats done and a third one started um melanie I thought of you while I was making this hat because if you notice, this is that gray variegated that you uh, you sent me. And then I put white with it, of course. But yes, this is that gray variegated. It turned out to make a beautiful toddler hat. Isn't that nice? I really think it's pretty. Um, it's gray, but it almost has a green hue to it. You can't really see it, but there's almost a little green hue to it. It's really neat. And then, just purely out of scrap yarn, I made this baby hat. So, yep. So, those are the two I got done to put in the donation bag. Um, then I started a third one, which is a large adult. Um, so, uh, I wanted to finish that, and I was watching, what movie was I can't remember. <sighs> Darn, I'm sorry. I can't remember, I was watching some movie which was really getting good, and it only had like 20 minutes left to it, you know, so I'm trying to make myself stay up and watch it, because I really wanted to see the end of it, you know, and I kept just enough sleep. Finally, I had to just <laughs> shut uh, Netflix down and stuff and go out and watch the rest of it tomorrow, you know, so, because <laughs> I just couldn't stay awake. Um, I've done really much so far. I, uh, uh, got dressed and, um, fed the dogs, heated up a can of New England, uh, clam chowder. Uh, I had a little bit of a sore throat. I've got a headache today. Um, and I've got some apple cinnamon going in the tart burner. And I'm planning on doing some looming. It's just kind of a day I try to relax a little bit more. And, of course, then I'll do my favorite thing, which is looming. Um, I probably won't go outside to paint because Brad won't get home until late. And, you know, later. And then, but I plan on doing some tomorrow, you know, because uh, he'll be um, off. I actually prefer it, and so does he, if he works nights, because it gives me a chance to get outside and paint for a while without, you know, he can help with the dogs. Um... You know, because I feel bad if I go outside and paint and I leave the dogs inside because they want to be outside so bad with me. But I can't handle all three of them by myself. So, you know, and it's not worth having one of them gone or something. So, I feel bad leaving them inside. Right, Charlie? But anyway, that's all that I really got going on. It's a nice, easy, peaceful day. You know, um... Not really anything going on. The RV park is kind of emptied out somewhat, so that's nice, about halfway. Um, you know, that's all we really got going on. I don't even really have a topic for today. Just enjoy your Sunday. Just enjoy your Sunday for whatever you're doing. And anyway, I hope you all are having a great day and have had a great weekend. Remember that I do love you guys. Oh, I did start, like, one thing is I did start my, my blog. The link is below, um, and it's has for 50 states. So I, I started my blog. I did answer emails last night. I answered comments and messages and stuff. So I've been trying to get a lot better about that, and I really do enjoy uh, responding to you guys so much. So anyway, I do love you guys, and I cherish your friendship so much. And I think you guys are awesome, and I will talk to you later. Bye.